So, have you ever wanted to start a blog? Well, that's a sign. And this test will help you decide which type of blog will suit you best. Are you ready? Grab a piece of paper and a pen and record your answers. I'll let you know the results at the end of the video. Now let's start with your personality. Which three words would you say describe you best? A. Creative, resilient, perfectionist. B. Attractive, confident, creative. C. Active, adventurous, social. D. Kind, funny, sensitive. Or E. Smart, focused, determined. Do you have any hobbies? Pick it if it's on the list. If not, pick something that's closer to you and that you'd like to try. A. Cooking B. Music, photography C. Hiking D. Reading Or E. Computer programming Now, choose a color that best reflects your personality. A. White the color of peace and cleanliness. B. Royal purple is my choice. It's the color of wealth and nobility. C. Green is the closest to me. It's the color of life and nature. D. My color is happy and joyful yellow. All the best things are yellow. Sunshine, autumn, dandelions, and bananas. Or is it E. Blue? This color symbolizes inspiration, freedom, and harmony. Maybe you can relate to that. What's your favorite way to spend a Friday night? A. I like to stay at home, cook dinner, and maybe bake something as a treat. B. I go out with my friends and we have fun. C. Go for a walk and wander around the city, preferably somewhere new. D. I like to stay in bed with a book or a movie and some snacks. E. I meditate, do some self-care, and think of my plans and goals. Now tell me, what's your favorite social media? A. Reddit B. Instagram C. YouTube D. TikTok Or E. Twitter Think of your budget and the way you spend money. Aside from food and bills, what do you spend the most money on? A. Kinchin utensils B. Going out C. Traveling D. Books Or E. Online courses Now, pick your favorite food. Again, if it's not in the photos, just pick something that's more your style. A. Something fancy-looking like seafood B. Salads and healthy food C. Something creative from a different culture D. Pizza Yum Or E. Coffee and croissant. Now, just pick an outfit that represents your personality. Make your choice and don't forget to write it down. A. Something comfortable and homey. B. Something fancy, expensive looking. C. Outdoorsy. D. Something neat and simple. Or E. Office style. Your birthday is approaching. There's a choice of five gifts you can receive. What will you pick? A. A set of new shiny pots. B. A gift certificate to a mall. C. A good and big backpack. D. A new set of books from your book list. Or E. Coffee machine. Out of these famous fictional characters, Who do you think is more like you? A. Monica Geller from Friends B. Jay Gatsby from The Great Gatsby C. Bilbo Baggins from The Hobbit D. Hermione Granger from the Harry Potter franchise Or is it E. Lisa Simpson from The Simpsons? What's your favorite vacation destination? A. A city life. 
staying in an Airbnb, going to local restaurants, and getting to know the city. B. A cruise, where I can fully relax and take good vacation photos. C. Remote places where tourists don't usually go. D. A beach. There's nothing better than spending time at the sea or by the pool and watching a movie in the hotel at night. Or E. The mountains, where I can be by myself with my thoughts and come up with new ideas. When you travel to a different city or country, what are you most excited about? A. Food. I love trying different cuisines. B. I love to dive into city life, visit restaurants and clubs, and of course, take many photos and post them. C. I enjoy the scenery and talking to the locals. I love to immerse myself in new environments. D. I love to wander around the city without maps and discover vintage stores and bookshops. Or E. I look forward to visiting museums and exhibitions. You're a traveler walking through the woods. You can go anywhere you want, and there are five roads waiting for you. Which one do you choose? A. I'll go towards the river. There's water and some fish I can catch. B. Towards the road. I don't want to get lost. The road means there's a city somewhere out there. C. I'll go towards the mountains. There must be beautiful scenery, and maybe there's a hiking trail. D. I'll go further into the woods and enjoy the experience. E. I'll just turn around and go back where I came from. I don't have time for this. You're on a vacation exploring old caves, and you find a magic lamp. You know what to do. Rub it! So you rub, and a genie appears. But what a bummer! The genie says that you only have one wish. Having three is a myth. What will you wish for? A unlimited supply of food, b. unlimited amount of money, c. a teleportation machine, d. the ability to travel in and out of fictional worlds, or e. the ability to freeze time. Now imagine you got access to a time machine. Where would you travel? A. I would stay in my time. I would rather travel across space, not time. B. To the Victorian times, with fancy balls and dinners. C. I would go to ancient Egypt or Greece. D. I would go a century into the future. E. I would sell it or start giving tours. Imagine that you already have a successful blog. What would you be most pleased to hear about it and you from other people? A. I love your aesthetic and everything you post is amazing. B. You live an amazingly interesting life. I wish I could be like you. C. You have amazing content and you inspire me to try new experiences. D. Your content is interesting and fresh. I rely on you for your recommendations. Or E. You inspire me to grow and be better every day. I hope to be successful like you one day. Now, count your answers. Do you have more of A's, B's, C's, or D's? Then it's time for the results. So what type of blog should you start? If you have more A's than anything else, then you should consider starting a cooking blog. You probably like cooking or baking, and it's a great way to share your knowledge with the world and try something new. The blog will motivate you to be better and learn more about your hobby. If you got more bees than anything else, then you should start a lifestyle blog. You're probably a very attractive and open person living a very interesting life. You're sure to find many friends, admirers, or just people who will love watching you and learning about your life. Did you get more C's? Fun fact, it resembles my report card. (laughs) Well, I guess you live moving around, and traveling is your true passion. A travel blog is definitely a thing for you. You're a well-traveled person, and you can tell people about it, sharing your experiences and inspiring people to explore the world. Was D your most common answer? Then you could try starting a blog about books and movies. 
You can write reviews, post quotes, make recommendations, or just share interesting details about what you have noticed. It's up to your creativity, and you'll find a lot of like-minded people. Finally, if you pick most ease, then you should consider starting a professional blog on the topic you're qualified in or a productivity blog. You're a hardworking and successful person, so you could share your secrets and inspire people. It's always good to have someone to look up to, and you are a great role model. That's it for today. So hey, if you pacified your curiosity, then give the video a like and share it with your friends. Or if you want more, just click on these videos and stay on the bright side.